Good morning, Anu. I've actually been looking at this exhibit called Oh, You Fancy. This exhibit has been here for a couple of months. This is the final month, though, Black History Month. And here at Charles H. Wright Museum, there are so much incredible programming. The man in charge of it all, Charles, you've got uh, one of my favorite things, and there's so many things that I love about this museum, but the incredible programming is really one of those things. Uh, tell us what you have going on for these. You know, we're really in the final weeks of Black History Month here. Oh, absolutely. Uh, we've had 14 programs this month, but today we're featuring Harriet A. Washington, the, the great author of the book Medical Apartheid, and she's going to screen a film, The Greatest Showman. That's at 2 p.m. today. It's free, open to the public. It's followed by a presentation and Q&A. We oh. ask the whole community to come out and enjoy that uh, last final show with Harriet A. Washington. Wow. Okay. Medical apartheid. What does that mean for somebody who might be watching and sure. be unsure? This book was a National Book Award, and it covers the experimentation on African Americans that happened from post-colonial times to the present. So it's a very uh, powerful and important book and a must read for those who uh, have an interest in understanding some of the, the dark history of, yeah. of the medical practice. Okay, and then the screening of The Greatest Showman, how is that connected? Well, within the show, it does talk about uh, uh, the circus, uh, P.T. Uh, Barnum Circus, and uh, the circus actually opened. It had African Americans in uh, cages, for example, with uh, apes. Uh, so very uh, startling uh, information and uh, that's revealed through that movie and here it will be detailing that. I did not realize that. Absolutely. Uh, mer medical apartheid uh, as the community continue to read and we're focusing wow. on that this month. Uh, I should say that um, Tuesday, February 18th, we're featuring the 2011 eminent Kresge artist, Bill Harris. He has a new book, I Gotta Keep Moving. And then we're going to close out the, the month. Of course, we ask people to go to our website. But I have a very important program with Nguji Wathi Ongo. And that's the book that you're holding right that's here, correct. and I know you're very passionate about. I, I am. Uh, Decolonizer of the Mind. Here's a gentleman that was nominated three times for the Nobel Peace Prize in wow. Literature. So he'll be joined by uh, Dr. Gloria House, who just won the 2019 Eminent Kresge Artist uh, in a conversation. And then on the 27th, the following day, uh, we have a workshop. Both events are free. Both start at 6 p.m. Again, that's February 26th and 27th. What an incredible opportunity to have Nobel, Nobel Prize winning authors and activists and people who have just such incredible insight and wisdom. And even the, the, the sad and terrible stories are so important to hear and learn about and educate ourselves about as we move forward. Well, absolutely, because if we look at the 400 years, it's really about still we rise, 400 years yeah. of perseverance, yes. and how African Americans uh, really continue to, to rise in spite of all the adversity. Yes, thank you so much. You're you can go welcome. to our website, WXYZ.com. We're going to put a link to their website so you can get a full list of all this incredible programming here at the Charles H. Wright Museum in Detroit. Anu, 